What's up boys? Happy Monday morning. Hey, just got out of the woods with Jules. Uh, sent you guys a text, man. If you guys have any questions, let me know. We're getting so close. I'm getting so excited, man. It looked phenomenal out there. Uh, the amount of moisture that that area of Colorado's got, you know, they're, they're probably somewhere between, I think it's four and six inches above average for this time of year uh, talking to Bart you know he's been hunting that same area since he was in high school and so it's really fun just to go in on horseback and ride with him and he, you know he's just pointing things out for me so things really come alive just from studying a map to actually seeing the lay of the land didn't get to see everything or a lot but you know it's kind of a trip for the wife but hey I wanted to get back to you you guys are asking about this guy uh, Garmin in reach so I'll try and I mean I just I'm driving to work and I had this thing from our trip and I thought hey I'm just gonna make a I'll make a video you guys can check it out and see if you think this is something that you're interested in but so it's an in reach uh, Garmin's the company in reach is the kind of the product line there's about four or five different models like this this is the in reach mini uh, it's about 300 bucks I think maybe 315 initial purchase but then once you own it it's yours uh, you do have to have a satellite plan where you're buying uh, satellite time uh, to communicate you know on low orbit uh, iridium satellites but uh, so this guy will obviously it's small it's easy to easy to just put on you know your belt loop whatever but it'll Bluetooth to your phone and then you're using your screen on your phone uh, which is a little easier to work with. So phone, Bluetooth to uh, inReach Mini, and then this will communicate over over satellite. So you can, I could text a phone number. So from the Iridium satellite down to cell phone tower, and there's probably something like intermediate relay that I'm missing there, but uh, so then cell phone tower to somebody else's phone. So you can text somebody, anybody that's in your contacts list, you can text them with this. Uh, so that's uh, that's pretty handy. But, um, you know, using the, it's got an app that you'll download on your phone and then there's probably about four or five major functions that you'll use on your, on your phone. Uh, you know, it's got a map, it's not as good as Onyx, so I don't use it too much, but uh, it's kind of a, kind of a backup. Uh, so that's kind of one function. The second, you know, that you use 90% of the time is the messaging. So it's got a keyboard. It's easier to text with your thumbs on your phone. It's a little faster. Uh, but then in combination, when you send a text, it'll show the location uh, that you sent that that text originated from. So uh, let's say, for example, we're texting Bart, you know, hey, big bull down. Well, he would see where that location, where that pin was dropped. And that way, you know, he can at least start moving towards a trailhead or get the horses loaded and, you know, get a trailhead of, uh, identified that he's going to access. Um, you know, and then uh, texting like other other hunters, like if we're going back and forth, you know, and hey, whatever, uh, just broke my left femur. Like, okay, well, uh, we kind of know where somebody's at and you can navigate to that, that pin drop. So that's a pretty cool feature there. Um, it does this does have like a keyboard where you can go through and select each letter but it takes forever you know the only time I've ever really done that is when my battery is going dead on my phone and I can't really text off my phone or it's you know you get into like a the battery conservation mode where you have to kind of shut these things down and then um, you know uh, there for a while I was texting Julie like I'd always tell her like about two o'clock you know kind of I sat down in the afternoon and help her elk are bedded and I'm gonna eat lunch or take a nap or whatever it is like that's usually when I turn this thing on and kind of just chat back and forth with her and that's when we kind of do the most of our you know what's going on um, exchange uh, so the plans that you've got um, the uh, so it's got an SOS button on there and when you hit that uh, again it'll sort of show your pin but it'll dispatch the Colorado search and rescue good Americans volunteers out there that will uh, do their best to come find you. So that plan is, I think they call it the safety plan, and it's like about 12 bucks a month. And I'm gonna pull these numbers out of thin air, but I think I'm pretty close. I don't know about this year, but so 12 bucks, and that's what I always keep. And then for like elk season, I'll bump up. 
I'm gonna go to the unlimited, which I think is about 50 bucks. So unlimited texts. I did try to do the, um, you know, kind of the moderate plan where you had a, uh, I don't know, let's say, let's say uh, 20. It was like a limited number of texts, 20 texts or so. <laughs> Getting on the interstate, uh, 20 texts. And, uh, and then if you go over that, then there's a significant penalty. Well, my, my bill ended up, it was like, I don't know, 75 bucks or something. If I'd have just got the unlimited for 50, um, you know, you're not watching the number of uh, texts or whatnot. You know, it's just kind of fun. I, I mean, I was answering texts from work and shit. You know, that's kind of just fun. If you're out there by yourself, like nothing else to do, to communicate with other hunters or friends and whatnot, and then not have to worry. So, uh, uh, yeah, so you're buying satellite time. Um, and then, uh, I don't know, I think that's about it, really. You know, you buy this, you download the app, uh, you get a subscription set up where you're buying time. And uh, you can, you know, you can jump from one plan to the next. I carry this thing on flights, cross country flights. I hook it on Julie's backpack. It's kind of a good insurance plan. You know, she's going on a hike with some girls. And, uh, even if cell phone service is kind of intermittent, it's kind of a good insurance plan to have that uh, SOS, but readily available. But it's pretty simple. I like it. Let me know if you guys have any questions, man. See you soon.